All right, we are recording. Now, it's really, really hard to use this thing because, uh, well, frankly, um, what I'm looking at isn't what's in frame. And second off, video quality is subpar at best. I think maybe the monocle has some, some might have sustained some damage. I don't even know if this thing records audio. Um, it's kind of uncomfortable. Um, extremely uncomfortable. And it gives you really bad double vision. Uh, I mean, if you use both of your eyes, you, you just get like a fog faded window in, in your left eye. You have no idea what you're looking at unless you close your right eye. And then you can tell what you're really focusing on. You open both of your eyes and then, you know, hopefully what you're looking at is in frame. So, let's see what the quality of this is. I mean, it's basically, I think, like a 1.3 megapixel webcam. And I am about three, four, yeah, yeah, I'm about, I'm about six, five, six inches away from my, my LCD panel on the, on the laptop right now. Really don't know what to say about this thing, uh, I was hoping to turn it into, like, a wearable video scanner with DVR functionality, but it doesn't seem like I'll be able to interface into it. There's, like, no composite input since this is just a, a, a USB webcam, essentially. When I plugged it into my computer, it just popped up as a USB webcam device. And uh, I don't even know what file format this thing's even recording in. Um, it's extremely hard to, to see the, the monocle itself and focus on what it's saying, like it says it's re I've recorded for 2 minutes and 20 seconds. It gives me the battery indicator, SD card, and recording symbol, but... I could see why this is a failed product. Jeez. Alright, I'm gonna stop recording and see what this looks like.